Hey y'all, Pastor Drew here with another daily reflection. Every Sunday through Thursday during the season of Lent, I'm offering a reflection on the greatest commandment. What does it mean to love God with all our heart, soul, mind, and strength, and to love our neighbor as our self? And today I have simply been reflecting and want to invite you to maybe reflect on this with me. What it means to love our neighbor is to love our neighbor exactly as they are. Not the idea of a neighbor, not a perfect neighbor, not only our good neighbors, um, not neighbors when we just have good fences, right? You know the old saying, good fences make good neighbors. But to love our neighbor exactly as they are, the reality of our neighbor, the people who live and work right with us, among us, to expand our definition of neighbor and to love them exactly as they are, not after they change, but to love them first, following the example of God who loves us without us doing anything to earn it. So sometimes we need to be disillusioned. Sometimes we think um, that we we need someone else, we, we require them to be perfect, or that we have to be perfect before we can enter into the action of loving our neighbor as ourselves. But it's something we can do right now, perfectly and perfect, to love the people around us as best we can, exactly as they are. So try and do that. Grace and peace.